don't, you don't hit someone over a joke, right? however bad it is, and it wasn't bad. That was like the tamest joke I would have ever have told. Well, Ricky Gervais is back to destroy Hollywood, specifically this time, Will Smith, over his meltdown during uh, the Oscars, and they still gave him the, the award anyway, and now he's resigned uh, from uh, the Academy. That's what you do, apparently, at this point. Uh, Ricky Gervais, who you know, has previously made a lot of edgy jokes about his Hollywood colleagues who actually doesn't see them as colleagues anyway and they've, they've been fine and they felt awkward and his argument and i'm going to show you the clip that he has about will smith is a joke is a joke obviously until you cross the line when it comes to inciting anything physical violence ironically the reaction to the joke was violence don't you don't hit someone over a joke right however bad it is and it wasn't bad that was like the tamest joke I would have ever have told. I, I, Jesus. And all these people saying, no, no, it's, it, it, was, it was joking about, someone said it was joking about her disability. <laughs> well, I'm going a bit thin, so I'm disabled. I, that means I can park right up next to Tesco's now. <laughs> well, that, in fact, there are so many like, ridiculous comments, but uh, what Ricky Gervais has been um, saying, is, it's, it's not just, about Will Smith and what he did. It's also about the whole of the Hollywood culture because that's, it's become a tribal thing. There are people in Hollywood, in the whole industry, who you are either team Will Smith or team Chris Rock or neutral. Like, firstly, when it comes to the actual action, the, what he did, you can't really not be against it. I don't understand what, 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 what's going on with them, Hollywood that they could justify in terms of anything uh, that's uh, physical it's, and it's not self-defense. Secondly, the whole culture is completely ruined. And it's not just now, it's been ruined for a long, long time. So it's, it's important to expose their behavior because these people have influence. They might not be elected politicians, but unfortunately they have everyday influence in terms of the culture. And it's not just America. Yes, Hollywood was born in America, but it's, it has a global international uh, influence over all of our lives at least at least in the western culture anyway and this is why and on the on the other hand as i always say the left always end up eating itself is a very very good example of what happened that night and the reaction to it the consequences is that the you got two different tribes of lefty liberal lefties in hollywood who are either team this or team that is that going to change anything no the whole point is people like Ricky gervais are rare and they are still fighting for free speech. They're still fighting to defend our values. Because if you don't have these people, you're going to have these idiots, uh, either like Will Smith, who would advocate for, in the moment, irrational moments, to go crazy. Or, the other side as well, overall Hollywood behavior, just ban speech. Because speech is violence, but what Will Smith did is justified. Thanks again for watching. I'm my TC and we are the media.